Very unusual theft to report tonight. Someone stole an expensive plant, and we have the video to prove it. As Fox with Jeffrey Lindboom reports, this wasn't just any plant, and the shop in North Portland is not happy about it. This is Reclamation, a locally owned plant shop, where last week Friday an extremely rare and valuable plant was stolen from them. Let's head inside to hear from a staff member who was there when it happened and said that she feels taken advantage of. There's nothing good in this world that comes from stealing, especially from small businesses that are barely getting by. Anna Kilborn was working a busy Friday when three people came walking in. They just seemed like very kind people, like the kind of people I normally talk to in the shop. I'm kind of hurt that they like took advantage of me. The group came in asking about rare plants. He said, um, do you have any elbows or ties? They had two elbows for sale, a rare kind of plant, even rarer to get young, as they can grow to the size of this one you're seeing right now. And the color was white, making it even more rare. She turned her back to help another customer. Came over here, grabbed the plant, pretended to like show his friend, turn around, opens his tote bag, and shoves the plant in it. They had just gone behind my back and stolen one of our most precious plants for sale. Meanwhile, I am showing the customer um, the perfect pot for her plant. The shop has all kinds of plants. Anna says most of them range in between $20 and $30. The second most expensive plant in the shop is the Philodendron Ring of Fire, costing about $100. Compared to the plant that was stolen, $500. When she noticed it was missing, since the people were so nice to her, she figured she'd misplaced it. I even had um, my mom come in and help me look for it too after we had closed and we couldn't find it anywhere. Finally, she asked her boss to check the security cam and sure enough, they saw it was taken. Screw you, <laughs> like you guys really suck um, and karma's gonna get you. She hopes they return the plant, but she's mostly upset about the lesson she's learned. From this experience, I'm learning that just because someone's nice doesn't mean they have good intention. And that just really sucks that I'll have to be more aware. For Fox 12 Oregon, I'm Jeffrey Limblum reporting.